guys, welcome to Vlogmas Day 22. It's 11.51 a.m. and I'm still on my PJs. I'm not planning on getting out of it till later. I don't know. I'm just uh, cleaning up. Look. Ugh. Yeah. I'm Okay, I'll turn the camera around so you guys can see. I'm organizing this cubby here because you know I need to purge some and also that and yes I'm purging that and this things too I don't know which one to just get rid of I have some over here I need to dust these and I have to um, clean all that because those are dirty so I have to wash them soon so here are my empties. I'll show you guys before I'll throw them out. So um, here's a one here. It's by Paul Sporin, Eczema Essentials, the Daily Moisturizing Cream. I really like this, but it's expensive. They're like about $25. Uh, they're on sale sometimes for 20 bucks, but I would pick it up again, but um, yeah, kind of expensive, right? And it is steroid free, fragrance free, and it's easily, um, it absorbs easily to your skin that's why I like it and very lightweight so yeah it immediately reduce itch and I have a very dry 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 skin so yeah I looking at you know like good um, moisturizing cream um, all the time so I try this out I might pick it up again actually so because that's empty and then this one is empty I love this one too but I am using um, the ordinary foundations I like that one too so if I run out of those I will go back and pick uh, one of these if it's still available it's the L'Oreal infallible pro glow and I'm in the shade 205 natural beige um, I'll just put that right now for my reference because I'm gonna throw this out right so yeah it looks like it's not empty but it is there's like a little bit left but and then this one, yes, I finished two, two of these in a matter of like a month and a half. <laughs> I picked this up at Dollarama. These are the Batiste um, dry shampoo. Um, yes, they are cheaper than um, its price in like a um, drugstore. Um, these are $4 at Dollarama, but I don't recommend getting it there But because it's so easy for you to like go through with one bottle like these are 120 grams and i buy the one it's like dove or whatever they're the same amount and that one is like i use it longer than these ones so and then fruits and passion this is not actually empty but it's been sitting in my um uh, drawer there for a while so i'm gonna just toss it this is the soothing cream by fruits and passion so that's a bye bye and then two body mint pure seduction by victoria's secret that's done and also this one is my favorite sea salt um fresh sea salt mango by bath and body works i love it i think i have another one i just have that and then lastly is this apple wood anti back hand gel yeah, those are my empties. Hey Derek, what are you asking me? Girlfriend. What about girlfriend? Um, I want a like um Kaylin. Kaylin? Yeah. As, as your girlfriend? Yeah, that's my classmate. And and is I thought you don't like girls because girls are boring. I like girls better. You, you like girls better now? Yeah. Okay. But you are so young still. But but Kaylin is young like me. Oh, oh my god. Well, well, how old is Kaylin? How old? How old are you? Um, we both five. There you go. You guys are both And yeah, five. too. Uh, yeah. Well, and everyone's five. Uh, yeah, maybe. Yeah. Okay, but you're still young for a girlfriend, okay? I know, I'm still on my jammies, but 
uh, I'm going to start mixing my meat for my spring rolls so I could start wrapping them tonight so I'll do that right now and then hopefully um, after I mix all these and get get ready um, I could shower at least and you know freshen up because I feel gross I've been cleaning and whatever all day so okay so let's start I'll place you over here I don't know where but I am doing the I place my bowl here using this I'll just fast forward it when I do Okay, so before I'm going to sh take a shower, I figured I'm going to show you guys um, my winter essentials, more on like skincare. Um, so I gather all of them and put it in a bag like this. Um, this is my favorite Victoria's Secret that I found at the thrift store. It's so cute. And yeah, it's not about the, the pouch, right? <laughs> but anyways, let's start. Um, these are just the skincare um that it works for me so it might not work for you and everybody's different these are just my preference that works for my skin i have a very dry skin um no joke uh, after i take a shower i slather everything up <laughs> to moisturize my skin and then just like a second it's like dry again so it's hard for me to find a moisturizer that really works for my skin so these are the stuff that you know like kind of work for me but I'm still you know um, looking for the best moisturizer um, if you have like suggestions or um, something that you think that works for a very dry skin let me know in the comments below and okay so let's start with my favorite and and I I've always uh, been using this maybe a year and a half now so I've been using the Aquaphor Healing Ointment. I have it in a tube and I have it also in the tub. I keep this at home and then this one, sometimes I bring it in my purse. Um, it's kind of greasy at first, but once it absorbs in your skin, then it's all like moisturized. It works for me. I will keep saying this, dry skin. <laughs> and also some spots uh, somewhere in my neck and also in my um, ankles somewhere near there I have like a little bit of spots of eczema so um, yes eczema because I went to the doctor and asked if this is eczema or psoriasis or whatever it is uh, sometimes I have it too in my hands and also in my neck over here um, but um, I don't usually have it on my neck it's just um, if it flares up usually it's in my hands or in my ankles so um, those are the spots and this one keeps it moisturized and it's not as itchy so that's that and also um, I keep comparing this one and the second uh, product I'm gonna talk about is this Egyptian magic uh, I just discovered this um, through Alice of Dallas. Um, she was raving about this like last year, I think. And I tried it and I will compare it this like 
those two together because what it does is very similar and also the texture um it's greasy at first and then once it absorbs it's just it moisturizes your skin um but the egyptian magic is more natural um natural ingredients uh it has olive oil beeswax honey bee pollen pro propolis and royal jelly and that's it while the aquaphor is more on these ingredients that i'm where is it now um the ingredients is pitrolatum mineral oil saracen lanolin alcohol fentanyl glycerin and bisibolol so yeah this is more in natural ingredients but if uh, i will choose one to like um keep using maybe i will choose the aquaphor this one lasts long in my skin um i don't keep reapplying uh, because i try this and then it's like a couple hours it feels like it's dry again while this one it it does last long in my skin so i really like that and yeah but uh, my son is using this right now i he have like dry skin too so i i use it on him and this one is more natural so doesn't have any scent at all even even the aquaphor doesn't have scent so that's good so yeah and then the next item is um i use it i used this before the bio oil just for like um pigmentation that i want to like um um use for an even like skin tone uh, for example i have some spots over here from acne that one is like almost going away and i use this like um before bed but the only thing that i don't like about uh, bio oil is the scent it's not overpowering scent but it has that scent that i don't like <laughs> Uh, I start using this when I was pregnant, but it didn't help. I still get like stretch mark. And the next item is um, this eczema essentials. Um, I've showed you guys the empties. Um, I also use the polysporin um, moisturizer cream. That one good. That that one is good too. But I have this one percent hydrocortisone, and this one is good. I've tried this like this is my maybe third one already i just use this if i get flared up like um for example my especially my neck i don't want um anybody will see that but right now nothing is there it, it's not itchy at all um my my palm over here um if it's like really red and inflamed and it it has like rashes or cracking or scabbing or whatever then i use this and it it you know it looks better the next day so this one works for me and yeah this one doesn't contain any antibiotics so that's good um yeah it says here temporarily relieves itching as well as minor skin irritation inflammation redness and rashes due to eczema so i like this one this one is around ten dollars at shoppers so yeah also i tried these o'keefe's o'keefe's i don't know um this one is the rough and red relief um soothing body cream um instantly smooth and calms dry rough skin um i didn't finish using this because it doesn't do anything in my skin just want to use it up you know um yeah this one smells good but i feel like it didn't do anything but it does moisturize my skin but not very long so that's that and then on the face now are we going to do the on the face okay this one really works for me i have backup of this like i have two backups already it this one is the first aid beauty ultra repair cream intense hydration for dry parched skin i use this just in my in my face and i really like it um it does work with the winter um season it's just it gets so dry and flaky um especially in in here in here um i just um put this on and it 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 works for me it, i don't get any breakout or anything so that that's good so if i'm not mistaken uh only sephora carries this um brand first aid beauty i'm not sure uh 
over here in Canada anyways I don't know about in the US so um, yeah I really like this um, for my face and the next item for face is this I white Korea aqua moisturizing whitening Vita um, I bought this in the Philippines while we were on vacation last Feb I bought three tubes of this this is my second one and I am regretting that I didn't get more than three because this is amazing I only have one left <laughs> so um yeah hello <laughs> whoever wants to buy no I'm just kidding um yeah this is made in Korea I like Korea this one is deeply hydrates with water-based formula so yeah it's very lightweight I like it a lot well it does have a scent but it's I, I, I like the scent actually very fresh you know so yeah i really like this i don't know where to get this here um but yeah if somebody um will go back to the philippines i might ask <laughs> them to buy me um yeah one of these and very affordable too i bought it at watson's in the philippines so yeah i really like it so the next item for face again is <laughs> this one is the ordinary alpha arbutin two percent Plus HA is the hyaluronic acid. This one is just to even out um, some of the dark spots that I get in my forehead and sometimes over here. Oh, it's actually like fading because of these. <laughs> well, I'm almost out. Or is it I'm out? <laughs> yeah, I think I'm out. But I have another one and i think i'm gonna reorder this is amazing i love it and it's very affordable as well it's like less than i think it was like only like six bucks or something less than ten dollars for sure um so i really like this the ordinary um uh, it's like a serum yeah it's like a serum so this is the application it's like a dropper like that so yeah pretty cool and very affordable I like that and then for lips um, I like the Carmex don't get me wrong that's one of my favorites but it's somewhere here oh it's right here guys I really love this is my first love here in Canada when I moved here uh, in Win winter peg in Winnipeg this is my very first lip care um carmex lip balm i love this it's for dry chopped lips and cold sores i have this in my car i have this in wherever like yeah so i love this very affordable as well but then i discovered this not too long ago this laneige lip sleeping mask looks like this i also have the baby one because I have like um, cosmetic bags that are small so this one is perfect but it's very very small product inside so but this one is $24 Canadian is it 24 yeah I think so 24 and it has like a lot of product in it 20 grams this one um it's it's like mask but I use it as a lip balm and look at that love this stuff I love, love this. I use it as a lip balm. I, I don't care. Um, you could use it as a mask. You could use it as a lip balm. Whatever you want to use it for. Um, but yeah, it's it's great for lip balm, lip care. When I wake up, it's like baby soft lips. Yeah, those are my favorite lip um, lip care. And also, speaking of lip care, I also love um, lip oils. Um yeah especially the tinted ones i have um four lip oils that i'm going to show you guys this one if you're into like affordable lip oil um the joe fresh has a lip oil this one it's called um essential lip oil high shine by joe fresh it has a little bit of like a tiny tiny tint but you can't tell but if you want like a bit more tint and want to spend a little bit more then the mac hint of color lip oil is the bomb like i have three uh, shades i have the kind of like purplish color i have the pinkish color and then uh, my favorite of, uh, of all of them is uh, this lala love you um it's like reddish but very sheer 
these are sheer but you could tell that they have like a tint to it um so yeah those are the lip um lip oil that um uh, i love and also lip tints are my fave as well um but right now lip oil is must for me during winter months so yeah those are the stuff um sometimes i do use a hand cream like this um uh, with the scent um from bath and body works you, you guys seen this in the haul um they are great but it doesn't really it moisturize for a bit but then you know you know this is just for like for the scented purpose but not for dry dry skin so yeah I'm just showing you guys this because I have it here uh, those are the stuff that I use for lip care skin care and all that stuff and yeah that's it guys yeah well thank you guys for watching I'm gonna go and uh, yeah freshen up I've been cooped up in the house for today but I hope you guys um, at least enjoy watching this vlogmas i know it's kind of boring eh but um yeah it is what it is plus it's snowing outside oh i can't feel my legs Oof. so yeah thank you guys for watching and yeah i'll see you guys in tomorrow's vlog bye